One can make the argument that my camera roll saved my life. While being disorganized and scattered, it always reminded me of why life was worth living. My parents emotionally and mentally abused me my entire life. They made sure that I felt like nothing and that my accomplishments felt like nothing. Because of this constant berating and shunning, I struggled with wanting to continue living my life. I struggled with these suicidal ideations for almost my entire life, pretty much since the time I was in middle school. My friends and extended family always tried to make sure to remind me of why they loved me by creating these memories um, that I was able to ha access in my camera roll. I will share with you some of these people that always went out of their way to make sure that I rem was remembered that I was loved and that people wanted me here. My brothers Mitchell and Luke always made sure that I had access to things when my parents decided that I no longer needed them, like clean clothing, food, soap, and other basic necessities. My grandma and grandpa always made sure that I had a clean bedroom and a good shoulder to cry on when I needed it because I was so stressed out and so emotionally exhausted because of my parents. My aunt and uncles always made sure to welcome them into their their households and would fl often fly me out to their households so I could spend time with them during breaks when they knew that I would not be able to get out of the house as much. I often would be able to watch and listen to music to avoid talking to my parents when I felt stressed or just over over my parents telling me how worthless I was. I would connect with One Direction, Wallows, um, Jordan Clarkson was a NBA, NBA player who because of his playing year after year I was able to follow him and his basketball career. I would continue living so I could watch his career and see what his life would follow, which I know sounds stupid, but it really helped me. And that's the same with actors. If they continued with projects and movies and TV shows, I would be able to continuously watch them and follow them. And so I was able to fall in love with these people. And because of their continuous work, I was able to make sure to follow them and be able to support them. These TV shows helped me realize my queerness and be able to help me understand who I loved and why I loved them. And it wasn't a shame for me to love any human, even if they were a girl or a boy or not, they didn't have a gender or if they were trans, anyone, I could love anyone, no matter what. I was able to connect with my aunt, who also struggled with mental health issues, and she would was able to reassure me that my not wanting to live was not something that I could I couldn't overcome, but something that I could embrace and help others learn to. I have a friend who struggled with an eating disorder similar to mine, and she helped me be able to understand my eating disorder and answer questions. She encouraged me to eat when I did not feel like eating. She encouraged me to get help when I needed help most. I had a friend, Ella, who pushed me to volunteer because she knew that I would be able to help me get out of the house more. I have now been able to help people in my community who struggle with abuse similar to mine and be able to find the resources that I was able to find and get help for similar situations like mine. My aunt and uncles always made sure to how let me sleep over and babysit so that I could earn some extra cash for my future and to 
have another place to stay when I was feeling sad. Um, my best friend Soraya always made sure to encourage my passions and push me to become better when I felt like quitting. My late grandma always made sure to make to help. She always encouraged me to talk about my passions and to up talk myself and to present myself well because she knew that when you talk about good about yourself, you will feel good about yourself. My little siblings always made sure to love me no matter what. My best friend Elena always made sure to try to make me smile so I would have those natural endorphins. Thank you for listening.